Shit. What's happening? Another glitch? Same one as before. Shay's back and Notre Dame. See if you can complete the memory this time. Did I fucking... Let's find out. What are these incomplete memories? I, I, I don't know what they are. Got it. Shay's in Paris, all right. I even got a date for you. Holy 1776. shit. At this oh, wow. point in time, Franklin was the American ambassador to France. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Otto Berg, professional killer and amateur historian. <laughs> Dope. Killed three criminals with air assassinations. Why? So he's looking for Benjamin Franklin for what, my dude? Yeah. Hell yeah, dude. Give me those fucking leaps. Damn, she looks old now. Somebody help! Il ne nous échappera pas cette fois. What? You should not have left your backwater colony. Well, I'll return to Boston. And Philadelphia. Shh. Don't say anything. Don't say anything. Just stay right there. Just stay right there. Just stay right there. That's what I'm fucking talking about. His name is Benjamin Franklin. Shay? Is that you? Ah, how long has it been? Uh, where are my manners? Thank you, my friend, thank you. But what are you doing in Paris? With all due respect, sir, this is no time to talk. You're still in danger. Yes, I... I must return to my family. <laughs> What is this, homie? What are these incomplete memories? They have something to do with Benjamin Franklin, obviously. What's up, bitch? I'm Shay Cormick. I like his outfit, though. It looks like um, that one black dude's outfit, kind of. I can't think of his name. The one who looks like Django. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to kill civilians. Let's just not consider that cannon, please. <laughs> Bitch! You should be safe now, Mr. Franklin. Mr. That's, wow, that was a horrible Irish accent. That was awful. Thank you, Shay. Please, wait for me. I just want to make sure my family is safe. Do what you gotta do. I'm Shay fucking Cormac. Where are these bitches at? They're probably all above me and shit. There's one. Two. They always do that. There's three right there. Alright, well I'm going up from behind, dude. It's the best way to do it right there. Going up from behind, homie. It's the best way to do it. It's my favorite way to do it. Really? Nothing. You're a fucking idiot. These assassins are idiots, dude. These are... This is Paris, huh? This is Paris, so we're gonna be kinda... Kinda dealing with the same... Similar architecture, the fucking exact same architecture, pretty much. There's one hiding right there, in plain sight. I don't know where the last one's at. Suck a dick, bitch. Oh, I didn't even see this there. Nah, you don't see shit. 
You don't see shit. Can I get the last guy in time? He's definitely gonna be like in the alley or something. Didn't even know that was an optional. I just kind of assumed it was gonna be like something bad. How? How did you do that? It was quite fortunate. I make my own look, Master Franklin. As I suspect you do. He says that, yes, dude. Yes, indeed, my good fellow. Yet, without your assistance today... Hmm. Well, you have my thanks, Shay. Is there anything I can do for you to repay you for this uh, kindness? Actually, there is. I need to meet a business acquaintance. I heard he would be at the Chateau de Versailles two days from now. And they don't just let anyone inside the royal palace. Very well. <sighs> I'll see what can be arranged. Incomplete memory too. Are these getting their own separate videos or... I don't know. That's the best we can do for now. We keep trying to sequence memories out of order, which is why we're crashing with this. What do you suggest? If we progress further with Shay's life in the colonies, I'm confident we can get better results from these Paris memories. Very well. Keep me informed. That's I'm like... the next memory sequence now. That's like every single Assassin's Creed game that we've played. If you try and do it out of order, it's just not gonna work. At least with Desmond. Shay Cormac. I hear you are the Templar's new don of precursor archaeology. I'm no expert, sir. I just witnessed what the Assassins can do with those damn sites. I have spent years investigating precursor leads. Tell me what you've seen. Hey, them well, I know both the Assassins and Templars are looking for pieces of Eden. Powerful weapons, mind control and apples, but this time it's different. We haven't found an apple, but... a tree. These temples hold the earth together like roots. Disturb them and Haiti falls or... Lisbon. Or any other place the Lisbon. manuscript shows. And the assassins are blindly interfering with these structures. Aye. And if we don't stop them, they'll continue destroying cities. I see. We have intelligence of assassin activity near Louisburg Fortress. We'll be meeting with a Royal Navy officer, James Cook. He recently gained a commission that could be strategically valuable. Gist has the charts. Very well. I'll depart shortly. Colonel Monroe spoke highly of you, Shay. He was convinced you could become the best among us. I expect you will not disappoint. I don't plan to, sir. <laughs> He's got a kid somewhere. I think so. Guest, do you know why the Grand Master is so interested in Captain Cook? Well, sir, he's very intelligent and ambitious. His knowledge of seamanship is second to none. And if I trust my favorite barmaid in Halifax, he also just became captain of his own man of war. He's <laughs> also an expert at deciphering secret codes. A man with such a skill is certainly an asset to our cause. The kind of fellow we should welcome in the order, then. Well, he's a friend of mine, but the man has an annoying habit of strict honesty and a total lack of anything resembling guile. Makes it a little hard to keep secret business secret, especially when his mathematical brain is clever at cracking codes. Consider him an ally, but watch what you say around him. Duly noted. James Cook. Doesn't ring a bell, honestly. I like how Gis is just like, oh, blah, 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 and he's a fucking, like, Templar. Take that fort, it'll be clear sailing down the St. Lawrence. Then on to Quebec and Montreal. The tide is turning. General Wolfe will give that craven Montcalm a right thrashing. I've been looking forward to that since Fort William Henry. With this bloody war, oh, we'll shit. Bring order to this I fear it would take more than that, friend. I'd like to see what level this man of war is. Level 60? Dude, come on. Let me capture it, broski. I haven't found a single level 60 man of war for my fleet, and it's kind of fucking annoying. Yes, he is. But the HMS Pembroke, Captain James Cook's ship. 
She's a beauty. Man of war, fully armed. We should bring the Morrigan alongside. Master Kenway will surely be waiting. It's just so weird hearing hearing Kenway without thinking of Edward. Welcome aboard, gentlemen. Good to see you again, Captain. Captain Shea Cormac, Captain James Cook. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Pleasure's mine, sir. Captain Cook uncovered a rather distressing stratagem, which I fear confirms our own intelligence. Indeed. As we speak, our Royal Navy fleet is on its way to Louisbourg. However, the He's French have drawn up a preemptive strike against it. If they launch this attack... Obviously, we cannot allow that to happen. Gentlemen, the Battle of Louisbourg could very well be the turning point which will finally bring this war to a close. I don't know about you, but I've had enough of war. Then may I suggest you take the wheel, Captain Cormac? I think you might enjoy piloting a vessel with real uh, firepower. Level 60 man of I war. I believe I shall, Captain. Dude, all right. Nice fucking wheel. <coughs> uh, excuse me. Oh, wow. That's a fucking ship right there, bro. We're jumping right into it with this fucking thing, aren't we? Wow, this is a big ship. Na, 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 na. Wolf, Lawrence, and Whitmore lead the three divisions of the Royal Navy. Who's their commander? Major General Amherst himself, back from Hanover. You take an interest in the war, Shay? Wouldn't want to disappoint you, sir. Wow, that's some. So he's an ass kisser. Shay, come on, dude, you're a fucking badass. You can kill Hathen right now if you wanted to. Cause, cause I'm controlling him. That's why I say that, obviously. Ooh. Ships like that in the dark and that kind of explosion, like lighting, just reminds me of Godzilla. Oh! Okay. Sink ten ships with mortars. I plan on it. Stop those ships. The outcome of the war may depend on Sinking everything I can with mortars right now. Ooh, gotta do that again to this man of war. We might be too close to this one, but that's okay. As long as we're sailing away. Ta -da! I sank all the ships I could with mortars. Nah. Ooh, why does that ship look familiar? Oh, it's out of Wally, dude. Yo. It's the Experto Crate, man. Oh, I'll be so mad if, I, if what I think is happening is about to happen. Dear God, fire ships. Should they break through, they would devastate our fleet. We'd better not let that happen. I recognize that vessel, sir. It's the Experto Crete. Oh, Wally. How fortunate he is that we have other priorities. Great. We have to get rid of those fire ships. Dude, I'm telling you, I didn't even think about it, like... We're Shea Cormac, we're a fucking Templar. Oh my god, if we have to kill out of Wally, I'll be so fucking mad, dude. Not gonna lie. Because obviously he's a fucking enemy now. Don't take damage from these fire ships. I plan on keeping these fuckers mortared. Keeping them at a distance. Nope, ain't letting them fucking damage me, my dude. 
That's the fucking Experto Crate, man. Of course, Adewale would be out. Oh, God damn it, dude. I'll be so fucking mad if what I think is gonna happen. It's inevitable, right? More enemy ships, sir. For real, dude? More fire ships. This is hopeless. We're absolutely wiser to fall back. Get the more in wisdom don't always mix, Captain. This isn't over yet, lads. Man the cannons! I was just spinning around. Yeah! Call in the Stunson! Pull in sails! I believe Master Kenway is correct, Captain. Mortis is most advantageous right now. Yeah, we're fucking working on it, fellas. Fucking working on it, fellas. We're right in their path. We have to sink that fire ship or get out of their way. Almost got hit by that fire ship, not gonna lie. Fire. It's okay though. We got this dude. Fire. Get out of range. I fucking got this dude. Those two frigates are fucking toast! Fire! They're firing mortars! It's okay, we Keep fucking got it. I'm just spamming the right trigger right now. It wasn't as, uh, as Fire! fruitful as I had hoped it would be. Hopefully, I got that ob ob objectional, objectival. We cleared the way just in time, Captain Cormac. The tide of war is turning! That was quite a crack, wasn't it? It is too soon for celebrations. But Wale is still out there. I'm sure we'll get another turn to dance with him, Master Kenway. You don't get to say Master Kenway and then talk about hurting my boy out of Wale. That's just not cool, that's just fucked up. Alright, that's what I fucking thought. I just, I didn't know. Sometimes, you know, you can't just celebrate too early, so...